Hey, kitty. <laughs> there it goes. What the? Hello, YouTube. Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Power Wash Simulator. And folks, we are back once again because for some reason this video did really well last time. I was a little confused because I kind of thought nobody wanted to see a game uh, where I just pressure wash stuff. So we're going to be jumping back into the career mode here today. So as you can see, we have two jobs. We have clean the bungalow and clean the playground. Well, I think we're going to clean this house because that thing looks absolutely filthy and it's gonna make us $550. So let's go to this. It's gonna give us some details about the job. Now, one thing I wanna go do, I'm gonna go look at the uh, the shop real quick. Is there anything that we can buy? I know we can buy some cleaning liquids. Like what would help us here in this job? Probably a wood cleaner. Let's buy a couple of these. Can I buy more than one? Oh, maybe I can only buy one at one time. That's kind of weird. So here's some of the, uh, the washers here. Let's see, we own this one. Do we own them all? Uh, I guess no actually I think we only own the light duty. Uh, I want to get this heavy duty one It's two thousand dollars or even a medium duty But we're gonna have to save up for a couple jobs for that So we'll probably save the rest of our money and we'll go straight out to the job But if you guys are excited for more of this on the channel be sure to hit that thumbs up button and let's go clean some dirty houses Holy man, this thing is dirty. Uh, do we have ladders in the game? How am I supposed to get up here? Oh no, this was a mistake. Look, the whole thing is orange. Okay, so where do we even begin? Let's go look at the backyard real quick. Like, what do you think the neighbors think when they see a house like this? How does this even happen? All right, so there's no loose junk in the back. It's really just the house itself. Oh look, there's a ladder. By the way, I thought the house was wood. It's actually, uh, it's like stone or something. Oh no. So we have the wrong cleaner. That's great. All right, let's see. Let's get the uh, soap nozzle real quick. We're gonna go ahead and put the, uh, let's see, we have wood. Do we have the universal? Is there any left? No, let's refill this real quick. At least we can soak this thing with this. Uh, it's a universal cleaner. It might not be the best for, like, everything. I mean, it's universal, but it might not be the best for, like, one focused object. Uh, but maybe it'll help us at least cut some of this grime off. Uh, we're gonna need a couple refills of this. Uh, let's hit the, uh, the bottom. The bottom looks the worst. Uh, the bottom grime is just absolutely fantastic by the way uh, I love this oh this is gonna be satisfying to clean okay hit this corner hit this back oh this thing is just bad like how does your house do this like especially compared to the neighbors houses it's like a mud tornado came in and just hit this house and that was it hey okay, there goes that all right let's just hit these heavy grime spots just get one layer of this stuff on uh, maybe even the driveway needs this. Okay, so there's that. Hit that upper upper part. Let's kind of spray off the driveway real quick. There we go. And let's do... We're going to do one more refill of this. Uh, I would use the other stuff. Uh, maybe I'll use the metal on some of the gutters because I have some of that left over from the last job. There we go. And let's go and hit that window. Hit that corner. Eh, hit a little bit more of this. It's actually doing a decent job taking off that bottom layer. That bottom layer was nasty. Holy man. All right, there we go. Okay, we have a little bit of metal cleaner left. Let's go ahead and hit a couple of the gutters here. Just try to make our job as easy as possible here. These gutters are nasty. Let's go ahead and hit those. Uh, this one's really bad. Hit that. Try to run along this. And we're already out. Okay, that's great. And we have our wood cleaner, which... Yeah, this would be for, like, decks and stuff. I mean, we got a little bit of wood around the windows. So let's go ahead and hit the borders there. Uh, I might as well use it since I have it. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. All right, so this thing has been soaped up. It looks a lot better, even with just the soap. So we've got that going for us. Let's go for... Let's see if the 25-degree uh, nozzle will knock it out. It probably won't. This is a pretty grimy house. Uh, let's see here. What do we got? Come on. Please tell me we can get it done with this. Uh, this is at least somewhat wide. Oh, that looks like it's knocking it out. Oh, let's get up there a little bit. And let's try hitting under the gutters here. Yeah, it looks like it's doing a really good job here. So this should get it done. Yeah. All right, we got this. All right, so I think the, uh, the way we want to do this, we'll do the driveway last. I want to get the house done. 
Uh, we'll get up to the roof. I think we're going to do that maybe last. Let's get the bottom. Let's get the driveway. And then we'll just save the roof. That way we'll use the ladders at the end. By the way, what is on the roof of that other house? What? Is that a, is that Garfield? That is a fat orange cat on top of the house. Can I hit it? Hey, kitty. <laughs> oh, there it goes. What the? Huh? That was something. I just sprayed Garfield. Yeah, I must say this job is actually a little bit easier than I thought it was going to be. And I really do think the cleaners are making a difference. Which, by the way, I've got a joke for you guys. So the last episode, I said, tell me your best power washing jokes, even if they're bad, which... Guess what? Most of them were bad, but I've got a couple to highlight here. So probably the best joke, which I actually chuckled at this one, was by Andrew P. It says, why does dirt never get a good paying job? And it says, because it's always getting hosed. Because power washing, dirt, jokes, and stuff. <laughs> Oh, no. Also, I've got one more. This is by your local pet Russian. Why can't the comedian tell dirty jokes? Because it always comes out clean. Get it? Ah, uh, yes. Clean jokes. I want to see more. Comment down below. We're going to do another round of this. And the highest upvoted jokes will be on the next episode. Oh, folks, watch this. Here we go. Here comes this driveway. This thing is nasty, but... Uh, with a couple good hits here. So we'll go across, do some stripes. Guess what? The uh, the front of the house is looking a whole lot better. Just don't look at the roof right now. Also, is there another Garfield on the roof? All right, pay attention, Komodo. Quit staring everywhere else. I know I know you want to do other things. I mean, this is satisfying and all, but uh, sometimes uh, my attention span gets really short and I want to like look at other things. Okay, focus on the driveway. I mean, but how can you not love this? Like, look at the clean. Like, I just want to go power wash my house in real life, even though it's clean right now. I just want to see if I can get a layer of dirt off. I'm going to go buy a huge power washer at the Home Depot. Okay, I think the driveway is almost done here. I just got kind of the center part to finish up. Oh, let's hit this top. All right, come on, Mr. Driveway. Highlight and tell me you're done. Oh, and maybe it's this angle here. Yeah, you gotta watch the angles of this. And somebody said the uh, the playground is really frustrating because there's a ton of angles on it. So I am uh, I'm a little worried about that. Uh, that's kind of why I chose to do the house first. Plus, I think the house would be more satisfying than cleaning up playground equipment. But eventually, we're gonna have to face that demon and do that playground. Which, yeah, that's gonna definitely be a thing. All right, there we go. Driveway's clean. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay, let me go ahead and work on the sides of the house next. All right, check this out. Wow, we've uh, we've done a lot here, on Hit this gutter. All right, so the front is pretty much clean. The sides are pretty much clean. Hold on, looking for a little bit more. Oh, a little bit up here. And a little bit on this windowsill here. There we go. All right, so that's done there. And then, all right, let's go up to here. So, we still have the back, which the uh, the soap is soaked in, so it's pretty good. And then we have the dreaded roof. I don't look forward to that portion of this, but you know what? It's going to be fine. We'll just go in straight lines all up and down it. Uh, it's not an overly complicated roof, so I don't think we'll have too much issue with it. Now, I'm really dreading the playground. Now, the more I read about it, I'm like, oh, this is not going to be fun. Uh, so if there's gonna be some maybe smaller jobs in between, maybe we'll take those and we'll save the playground for the next episode since it's a big job. But I'm not sure if anything else is gonna unlock. So if nothing unlocks, we're gonna have to definitely go to the playground. Oh boy. So I've been getting text. Uh, apparently we're actually cleaning for old people. So I think the son hired us to uh, watch the, uh, the grandpa and grandma's house. And they're apparently watching out the windows, which is a little bit creepy. But, I mean, come on. How did your grandparents' house get this bad? Did nobody notice this? This almost seems like uh, maybe some elderly neglect or something. Because this house was filthy. All right. So, I think the whole base of the house is pretty much done here. Hold on. There's a really hefty spot right there. There we go. But, yeah. Now, most of it's done. We're ready to move to the roof here. So, let's see. We got a stepladder and we have this bad boy. All right, so we can just place it right here. 
And then we're ready to walk up and... Oh, we get to blast the roof and we get to spy on the neighbors. Wow, this thing is really, really grimy. Uh, it says it needs universal soap. Uh, this might be a good idea to refill that. So here we go. We got universal soap. Let's soak the roof real quick because there's some really, really heavy spots here. Uh, I see some green and other uh, colors up here. Uh, I'm not going to waste any more money, though, after this, because uh, I don't want to make the job not worth it. So uh, let's just try to hit maybe the edges. That seems to be the worst spots. All right, we're making some major progress on this roof. Uh, the chimney itself is going to need, like, a high-pressure wash, like the, uh, the red nozzle, because this thing is ridiculous. But, I mean, look at the other side. It looks pretty good. There's a couple little green spots that are also going to need to be hit uh, with the high-pressure uh, nozzle, but... Other than that, like, this is gonna definitely be a five-star job. Hopefully we get a good review on Yelp and stuff like that. I'm hoping that's what actually unlocks all the other jobs. I'm assuming it's uh, via stars. So say if we were to abandon this mission now with the four stars, maybe we wouldn't actually unlock some of the other jobs. But it is a little concerning that I haven't gotten any uh, notifications for uh, more available jobs other than the playground. All right, here comes the chimney. Uh, high pressure, let's get this done. Should be fairly easy. Uh, washing all the grime away from the top. All right, hit this. I, I don't think this house has been clean. How old do you think these houses are? I would say maybe they were built in the... We're going to go with the 70s. I don't think it's been clean since the 70s. Like, the amount of grime on this is completely unacceptable. There we go. Okay, so I think the roof's clean. We still have to do the gutters real quick. That, I believe, is going to be the last spot. But we'll have to go over everything because... There's always that one little area you miss uh, that you didn't even know you had, and yeah, it's going to be a thing. Oh, this is dangerous. Uh, all right, here we go. Come on. Oh, this whole gutter is filthy. Yeah, this is just a really bad spot to be standing, though. I feel like I'm about to fall off the roof of this house. Okay, there's another gutter cleaned. Ooh, what are we lacking here? Okay, it's this gutter. Okay, so let's hit this one. Is this going to be our five stars? No, it's still not a five star. Uh-oh. Okay, here's the question. Which portion of the house are we missing? It's probably something really simple and really stupid. Uh, look around. Something's going to highlight here, right? Uh-oh. Uh, that's not good. Maybe it's in the backyard? I think we missed something back here, right? Oh, no. Why don't I have five stars on this? Is it uh, under there? No. Uh-oh. Uh, over here, potentially? Over here. What am I looking for? Is it is it this? Is this this not clean? Uh folks, I'm a little stumped at the moment. Give me a second. Alright, maybe it's this window frame. I feel like there's something on here that's not complete, and it's kind of telling me that there isn't. But what is it? Is it under here? Oh, there we go. Boom! Job complete. Ha <laughs> ha, we did it. Alright. Let's go ahead and resume, and oh, you can see uh, the nice time lapse, me soaping it down and completely spraying off that roof. That was nice. Okay, so it looks amazing. Let's go ahead and continue. Did we unlock any? Oh, no. We didn't unlock any new jobs. We unlocked the playground. Well, we could start this thing. Uh, I don't think we're going to finish it this episode, but let's take a look at it. Uh, I'm kind of disappointed we didn't get any small jobs here. So yeah, this is a, a ridiculous situation. Uh, it's obviously... Oh, there's a ton of equipment. Wait, is that the whole floor is dirty too? Oh no, yeah, we're going to need to buy a couple things here. Uh, let's save our money because we are going to get a upgraded washer soon, the heavy duty or the medium duty one. Uh, but I do think it would be good to maybe buy a couple soaps. Uh, maybe like a plastic cleaner, a universal cleaner, wood cleaner, like pretty much all of it. Uh, let's buy, let's buy all of them real quick. That way we can refill whatever we need. And, uh, yeah, let's go look at the job. Holy man, what were the kids doing here? This is completely dirty. All right, so there's a lot to wash here. You've got the big, uh, stegosaurus. I think it's a stegosaurus, right? Uh, you've got the mat here, which is a universal, uh, stegosaurus. Oh, this is plastic. I kind of thought that was metal. Uh, you got plastic, a lot of plastic, a lot of wood, and then you have universal for the bottom. Uh, let's at least try to knock out one of these things. This thing is ridiculous. This little playpen, or, uh, jungle gym, whatever you want to call it. Uh, wait, can we go up and down the slide? Can I slide? Hold on, can we go? Wee. Yeah, how would you like to pass by this park and you see the power washing guy just sliding up and down, having fun? 
All right, um, you know what? Let's hit this thing. So this is a plastic. Uh, let's put our soap nozzle on it. Uh, did I buy? Yeah, I've got a plastic one. So let's go ahead and spray this bad boy down real quick. Make it easy. Knock off some of those layers of grime on it. Uh, there it goes. Uh, spray up its butt. This is weird. Um, go around here. Get the stairs. Try to get the uh, at least all the outside real quick, and then maybe we'll have enough to go kind of up those stairs with it. Uh, there we go. All right, so let's kind of walk. Okay, let's walk up this side of the slide. Oh, this thing is nasty. Ooh. Okay. And we'll walk down here. And we're out of soap. So, uh, let's move to... What do we think is going to get this done? Will the green nozzle get it done? Oh, let's hit this top part. Oh, yeah, this is doing good. Okay, so it's really not that thick. It's more of a mud. Uh, there is some grime on here, but it's, it's not too bad. This uh, inner part of the slide looks pretty ridiculous, but uh, we could probably hit this outer... Uh, sections of this and get it clean. Oh, let's try to just start from the top here. I want to try to do this one in a nice order. So let's go boom. Uh, the biggest thing, obviously the jungle gym is going to be a nightmare because of the angles. I think that's what everybody's talking about. But also the mat itself just looks like it's going to take a lot. So yeah, we're definitely not going to finish it this episode. We'll probably finish it next episode and then we'll take some more jobs. But by the next episode after this job we should unlock another power washer and hopefully it's going to make our lives a whole lot easier hold on see this over here there we go see this is coming off nice this isn't that bad at all all right this thing is cleaning uh, really nice but there is a lot of spots that need to be hit with the high pressure let's try this one is this going to get it done yeah that looks a little bit better what about the feet the feet are really grimy look at this Oh, yeah, that knocks right off, though. Okay, so we can get this done. So, yeah, I want to get at least this area done, and then we'll move around. Wait, I can roll this. Yay, there goes the soccer ball. Okay, don't get distracted too much here, Komodo. You got a job to do. Uh, you're getting paid a decent amount of money for this. Uh, like I said, if my YouTube career ever ends, <laughs> I kind of want to do this. Is this, like, a legit career? Could I make a thing out of this or maybe a company? And we just go around with a bunch of power washers, kind of like a biker gang. Uh, maybe we'll show up on tricycles. And uh, we'll go in and we'll wash your stuff. Uh, because I feel like this would be fun to do. Man, this Stegosaurus is already looking pretty good. On, oh, let's get the underside of this thing. Uh, I imagine this is where a lot of the grime is. Oh, yeah, it's bad under here. Come on, let's get this. Uh, let's try to get the back section. Okay, get up into here. Uh, this is awkward. We're washing the underside of a uh, Stegosaurus. I keep saying Stegosaurus. I hope I'm right. <laughs> uh, I, I don't keep up with dinosaurs. You know, that used to be a thing when I loved when I was a kid. I was like, oh, yeah, dinosaurs, dinosaurs. Everything was dinosaurs. And now it's like, I, I don't remember half of them. I know, like, the T-Rex. That's about it. All right, there we go. I think the uh, the dinosaur is done. Hold on, let's just kind of get the ground around it because I already know it's going to be a pain to go back and get. So there we go. Kind of work our way into there. Get under there. And then we'll work our way right around to the head here. So yeah, this mat is really, really bad. It might actually be worth it to maybe soak this. Actually, I know what we really need to soak. We need to soak that playground area or the uh, the jungle gym, whatever you want to call it. This thing is bad. Uh, we can go ahead. I think that's where we're going to about end it. But let's go ahead and put a little soap on this. Just kind of see what happens here. Let's get our soap. Uh, do we want to use a universal? Let's try a wood cleaner real quick. So if we were to just, uh, I don't know, start hitting this thing. Is this uh, helping with the amount of grime that's on here? Oh, man, there's even high spots. I hope I have some ladders uh, because I think we're definitely going to need those. Oh, yeah, we got some over there. Yeah, this this is horrible. <laughs> I can already tell you, this is going to take a little bit of time. So this is probably def definitely worth it to just soak and get kind of moving by the way this soap uh it depletes so fast okay kind of getting there i uh, might even hit it with a couple like universals i just hit a couple areas and just kind of spray it over and let it soak I i'm really hoping this is helping uh, somebody can answer down in the comment section below like how, how much does the soap actually help i'm hoping it's a lot because we spent quite a bit of money on it but anyways, I think that's going to wrap it up for this episode. Look at that. Quite a bit came off with the soap. So I'm going to definitely say that was worth it. But anyways, that's going to wrap it up. If you guys want to see more of this, you know what to do. Hit that thumbs up button. Tell some jokes down in the comment section below. And we'll see you guys next time.